A lot of people have projection of what it means to dedicate yourself to a cause and what does it mean to be an activist and what does it mean to be a feminist and we have all these awful projection you're supposed to be ugly unfashionable miserable not go for vacation not go you know and I really lived all of these things because I thought this is what's expected of me and I remember going to a therapist and she said when was the last time you got into a, you took a vacation that's like three years ago and she's like go on vacation that's all what you need but then I remember what switched for me is I remember being in an assessment trip to Congo and I sat in a village and it was men and a women in a circle. And at the end of the conversation, I said, thank you so much. I really appreciate it for your sharing. And they said, no, 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 thank you. You're coming here and you're talking with us and your smile um, really helped lift us. So thank you for this. And it was like a light bulb went in. It's like just you being a healthier individual, happier individual, that by essence helps you be fully there with them. So when you see the images of me dancing, and I love dancing when I go to Rwanda or Africa, different, anywhere, anywhere, or Bosnia, I'm just like fully there. And I just realize the more, the healthier I become, the happier I become, the more, the better I do my job. <laughs>